that CK could be a good option right here. It looks like they're gonna have to make do on Navi sides and M19 have to fight to stay alive. Yep. This is a single elimination bracket. The losers out, the winner will move on. Our other match. Prepare. This seems very liquid esque. You're facing elimination, last pick brood. <laughs> <laughs> No flame, See, just out. that's just kind of how it is sometimes. Yeah. Question is, can they pull it off like they would can? Like the first blood to be in his lane, just due to the nature of the way he plays. As he make it run down here by the doom, first shockwave. Well, turns out you were right. The roll comes out of mid though, and the to try and trade to pull up stun from Roger. He's Front fast though. Pikachu, but he's pretty fast and pretty healthy with the regen. Kind of crazy that plus 13 without Tango. Oh, the reaction though! It's a long range nukes here from both sides. Actually, and they, they got the more slow. Each. And Mura looking for more. He doesn't heal this time. But no one else wrote it again. Kyle is just busy shooting creeps. Really helping out either. Additional shots as they may go on the brew here. He's even quite a lot of six plus yet himself. Trying to get the clap off at least. But this is what you want to use, race. Reek, at least. So, Who's been actually made up top life here. He used to rage a little bit earlier for some harassment. Now, Seneca has to come in to link up with him. He gets lifted up to the end. The still going now. The extra rage not enough, though. And now, Seneca, he's like by himself. He runs down and on the stun of the right wing Doom with a double kill. Dark Wave once again. That is the second one. So, this Doom rotation, you can see. He's only split, still 40 seconds on the sideline. Middle lane. Middle lane. Oh, they're running down. Queen of Pain. To get another link off. He can just in time, but... Well, they do. Turn things around. They do bring down for slice. They look for general as well. They might need to throw them up. They take a little to it, and they will. Just to make sure. It doesn't really have the extra slow. But well, then a shockwave again. Pikachu with the new. One on the Wyvern here, though. But on the high ground, but spotted out, they're still bursting down Muriel. That'll be enough to roar. Same time with Broodmother, so they get two points special. Maybe, yeah, it's just in time, but turn around there. Nyx as well as the Broodmaster. They trade for Beast. Now, Doom, for more yeah. Doom on to Crystallize. Uh, no more shenanigans from him. Metal stun there from Roger, but not enough to help his buddy out. So, two for two trade, and overall, a little, little bit in favor of M19. And now blink forward. Ah, uh, just throw off the ultimate. That'll be enough. Shockwave should be needed. Not even fighting shape right now, even with the Kaya. Just gotta wait for someone to come back to be okay. Down the double stun available here. The burst down doom after all. Then it's Snake together. Hopping to this after the chaos. All of a sudden, five heroes from Navi down in the bottom lane. And another level two. She could be enough damage. Oh, the stun there as he's trying to farm with the free wave. That ensures it. What oh, a heads up is. play by Roger. Careful Sumner here, closing that. Oh, the weird okay. That's a boost with available to get it off, though, Bendy. The only one point I'm going to be on stage with Waltex, but that's the kind of play that at least lose. Oh, oh but Uriel, though, look at the stamina shit in Necrobook. Doing so much work here with all the extra degrees. Who's seeping? Uh, looks like it's uh, the Necrobook. Alright, that is good. They're gonna burst down Snaker first. No way out for him. Something seems familiar about last game. Hey, where are the other lanes at? Creeps actually gets the metal from the pain. Sending them over, but they want the real beast master in general. Nexus is here. Fall. He should end up falling here. They do have the Sonic Wave here if needed, but they're just holding on to it. A couple of Viking teams broke down, but on summons, but yeah, they finally let it go. Alright. Oh. Dendi. He's got his heads up if he unlocks. Well, the Pikachu here, roll it here, and then set up by Roger and the roll coming through. Dendi, just with a drive by kill. Kill secured, Bloodstone typical, secured. Yeah. Typical carry team for the country. And with Doom off cooldown, yeah. it's waste of time. Mid lane. Did they get it off here, Mana Burn, but he does have, did have enough. Radiant's bottom is under attack. Yeah, that's all good, because, well, Roger will control this fight. 
10 bottom, not too much damage being done. It could still could be a bit of a bother. Is under attack. More to deal with. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's a few Rio's best ways, too much time for this, but everyone to bait the Doom onto the Rio. Uh, onto the Rio Storm, so that's gonna be a big kill. Muriel still alive, even the roar onto Doom. Not enough damage here from Muriel on the side. General thinking about committing for it, but this is just the end. Gonna be alright. Surprise. I'm surprised Crystallize didn't go in. And it's a big deal to get thrown down at 10 blood from Fergus. Just really too much immediate. 3 2 2. Something like that. Oh, Brutus. continues though. And that was. Uh, Look at like a little bit more, so it comes back for the three B kill. Meanwhile, general target is the bigger one. They catch him with the little scars. Fights for all time. Lizzie and Nixie come in. He should eventually go down. He's back on the top here. Radiant Mana left. Coming in. Once find the Doom, we'll have to burn some more of his mana on. Just slice his here. That will work. Relocate forward. Nick's trying to TP out. Will not be successful here. Just enough damage with the extra burst on the spirits. That's like the difference between like a godly wisp player and a good wisp player. Yes. Yep. It's the orchid available for that thing. Well, up top. All right. Just eliminating the. Maybe we Maybe gotta pick up. Interesting play More from you. <laughs> Top lane. Oh, mid lane here, the Orchid on Beastmaster. Quite a bit of damage, Beast Jew. Yeah, it's worth. Gets the uh, extra 400 gold from the. Nako's done too. And the double kill. Okay, he just got like 1200 gold off of that engagement. The pipe cap shows 900 because it doesn't actually count the. Uh, Echo box. So we get 1300 golds off of that. And another bit of pressure for the tower. This time to use that. Relocate, no risk. Okay, he's spying back. Look at where Roger is. What happened? With a wraparound. Very ripple creeps trying to make that play again, but do have some split. Throw up some people, but rest is already down. Pikachu and Nick are focusing down. Doom on Roger mid, he'll go down. Great amount of right click damage. He will fall indeed. Still looking at this, uh, this die set base to see if Navi can do anything about it, but they can. Shrine. Got the plus fallen. 75 with Sage Will Hunger and Life Steals. Let's put it up to right here. What? 200 extra damage? Yeah, it's Navi. Like 210, 217, or 250. Here, agents is down, they timed it out, so now General actually takes Blink into them, but General wants well, more than Pikachu. But that's the kill ultimate off, the silence, prevent the roll, Pikachu with the ball. So all right, we see it, Nyx next on the list, signs up as well, but there it is, the wind is cursed. Latest a little bit more, General will fall, but also need enough time for Nyx to actually get out, but Roger actually running right into him, Nandy will come in for the follow-up. Also claim an extra bloodstone charge, we'll have this light up top. They spread M19 way too thin, they get killed, that's right in the center. Including two on a big horse, especially Pikachu. Radiance top tower has fallen. LK gold. They relocate available here. No one to link up with. Only the IO is close enough, but again, there's the wall. Find coming up is already up on the high ground, no way away from Navi going in. They're still trying to look him down, but un unsuccessful. Yeah. Ah, they expended quite a few of their ultimates and uh, Well, what this goes, not sure about this one. Bit of a miscommunication perhaps. Yeah. Hoping that there was a few more heroes next to him to kill him. Look at that gold for Doom. Looking to finish it off, but now the heals from Uriel. Again they say no. General Roger, ready for the follow-up, but they actually missed the sun. Doom is still alive, so what's going on? He's actually sitting down. Oh, good, oh, Spike Caribou. Also, that being dodged from Spike Caribou's Roger, I think, is still not long for the world. So, Q play, um, but at the end of the day. I'm not sure if it's still in play, but we may have a fight mid, so I'll just shut up. Roger. Find a big stun on the top. One finds half the food, half the final show. It stands up with a blink out. There it is, the ultimate. We'll keep him in, but he's nice to move on a bench. Now the hex to follow on to the eye of the one. 
behind both of these, and they should be able to. Now V, not in any position to help out their buddies. Snake with a tether. The blink out from General, that was... Time to work away, and this building picture is there for the wall the back line. See, they're looking for the tomb, but it's being healed up, delayed quite a bit here by the Winter Wife. Now silence up on Muriel. He will fall instead. Doom does come out though, onto Life Stealer. His rage will go off, the right clicks, the nets, everything being dropped on him, and first flies will fall. He doesn't fly back, then he's still in the middle of that. He will finally come out that secondary target. The big damage shields are still there for M19. They Back on status, might be back up at this point. Half through split, they have insatiable hunger. On Saints and Sages, they could go Ryback and Dendi. Ryback and Crystallize, alright, they can't get Roshan right now. In fact, they need to take fight. Am I general? Blinking aggressively, and he's the one who's about to be busted down. Knight with his curse, he also finds Nako. And uh, yeah, I'll set up to make sure the general can make a turn on play. Two heroes down. Yeah, if I back immediately, Roger will fall, please like this one away, then he's out of mana! He's being silenced up, and right click down, gets an eye off, but it doesn't really matter. That's a die back at him, and they're looking for more crystallized that can bring down this life stealer. And it's all over, but the crying, the rage will delay things a little bit further, but now the net comes out, damage over time. Four heroes on an RV, and GG is called! That was a Hail Mary play, but General blinking in like that. M19 just quick on the fingers, ready to turn around and ready to do them, which is insane. Well played by them. They just saw their kill opportunity and went a lot better with how they managed their creep ways, pushed it out, and they addressed the issue. Won this game, they deserve it. Will Navi bounce back game two? I think they can do it.